Hey, what's going on guys? Ty Friday here. Welcome to a tutorial about audio and capture cards. About eight or so months ago, I made a tutorial about how to get audio from your capture card because for me, I wasn't able to get anything out of my mirror box at the time. Okay, starting off, uh, you're going to want to make a scene. I already have a bunch of scenes that I don't really need to remake again. So we're just going to keep the one, but we're going to do my full screen one. Uh, so right now we have my camera that I can deactivate. Oh, there I'm go, and there I'm go, that doesn't make any sense. So here I am. Uh, we have my audio capture, which is my microphone over here on the left, and then you have obviously my, dis my display, which suddenly switches when I do that? No. So uh, as you can see, there's nothing here. When you're here, once you have your capture card plugged in and everything, you're gonna come into the sources box right here. You're gonna go add. You're gonna find video capture device, and you're gonna open it. You're going to click on it, not open it. And you can name it whatever you want. Uh, for, for me, I'm just going to name it uh, Capture Card, I guess. So you name it Capture Card, whatever. Click on it. Oh, sweet. I have Security Breach open. That's even better. So once you're here, uh, it's going to open this. So no, it's going to open this, and I don't know which one it's going to uh, equip it on. For me, it was my actual Game Capture HD60S or your capture card, um, or my capture card, I guess. Uh, but it may open up on the OBS virtual camera, which looks like this. So whatever, it doesn't really matter. Click on the device and change it to your capture card, which in this case is my Game Capture HD60S, which you can see I have Security Breach open on it. Now, with this open, the thing that really you have to make sure you do to make sure you get audio from this is scroll down and put it's going to see you're going to see audio output right here it's going to say capture audio only what you're going to want to do is press use custom audio device and with that you can click on it and then you can push capture card game capture hd 60s and in doing so you press ok and then you guys can now hear my game on my PS5, which I cannot because I don't have it open, but you guys can, which I'm gonna mute it for right now. And then obviously you can drag it up if you wanna have it as a source. So now you can't see anything, my camera's not even there, and I'm actually just gonna make it smaller. And then I'm gonna move it up one, so you can see. So now here it is, and then if I unmute it, you can see that the game is here. And if I do things like this, you can see that I have it all open and I can, oh, it's a flash, whatever, see? So that's how you do that. So yeah, that is simply the easiest way to get audio through your capture card. On the old video, I did see comments talking about all sorts of bugs that happens with it. I don't have an easy fix for it. Uh, the only thing I could say is if you're gonna buy a capture card, do not go cheap with it, just get an Elgato. It's so much easier to use, and it's the quality is so much higher than anything else. So, on that note, thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like down below and comment saying that you subscribed or that this helped even more than the first one, and I'll try to reply to as many of your comments as I can. Bye-bye.